morning bumblebeezies happy wednesday happy hump day so it is 7 43 right now and i am about to make my coffee but f before i do that i wanted to talk to you guys about what's been happening on youtube with the ftc and coppa now if you guys don't know what i'm talking about you should just look up coppa here on youtube and you'll find like a bunch of videos about it but basically Everyone now is required to mark their videos as made for kids or not made for kids. And if your video is made for kids, you lose a lot of things. <laughs> you will lose comments, no personalized ads, no notifications. So if you upload a video, your subscribers won't even know that you uploaded the video and other things. So basically if your channel is specifically for kids it's gonna really suck I mean there's basically no point in uploading a video anymore unless you just do it for fun if you're doing it to make money there's gonna be like no point which really sucks for a lot of creators so now I'm thinking like well am I okay like are my videos okay I don't make my videos for kids yes my channel is kid friendly but I do not make my videos specifically for kids like, I talk about my life and stuff. Like, I don't talk about, you know, little kid things. So now I have to go through all my videos to make sure I mark them correctly. Because if you mark your video incorrectly, let's say I mark my video as not made for kids, but Kappa sees it as made for kids, they can now fine you $42,000 per video. That's insane. So yesterday I started going through all my videos. I started from like the very beginning. I have a lot of videos you guys. I had over 2,000 videos. It was like 76 pages of videos on YouTube. So I started at the beginning and I was just looking through all my videos and I just deleted a bunch of videos because I don't even wanna like have them on there if they're made for kids. So like for example, the videos of Vanessa making pop in cooking, that kind of could be like for kids, right? So I just deleted all those videos and any other videos that might be like toy related in, or just like kid related, I just deleted a bunch of videos. I think I deleted like 30 videos. That's not that many compared to how many videos I have, but that's insane you guys, $42,000 fine. Nobody has that kind of money. That's crazy. So basically YouTube is going down <laughs> and it really sucks if your channel is for kids. If you're like a kid content creator. Yeah, so that's what's been happening. Also, while I was looking through my videos, I noticed that I hit 50,000 subscribers on like November 27th of 2018. So that's been like almost one year. And this is really sad, you guys. Literally, this year, 2019, has been my worst year on YouTube. Since I hit 50,000 subscribers, I only gained 700 subscribers. In one year, I only gained 700 subscribers. Literally, my worst year on YouTube, you guys. Like, the algorithm is all messed up. They don't promote videos like the way they used to promote them. Like they don't make your videos visible and then they took away comments which I'm pretty sure made it worse because people like comments. Me, I, I will admit I like to read people's comments. I will go to someone's video and while I'm watching the video I will like scroll through comments because I like to see what people say. So I'm pretty sure that had a big effect on my, my videos, my view count, my subscribers. So anyways, I'm going to make my coffee now you guys. So I'm gonna use a Christmas mug. This is the mug that I'm gonna use, super cute. Did I use this one last time or did I use this one? Maybe I'll use, okay, now I think I used that one already. So let's use the stitch one, because I don't think I used this one yet. Super cute. It matches that, that other one. So the other day I started my tocino. This is it right here, pork tocino. It's cured pork and it's been in the refrigerator for I think two days. Did I start this two days ago? I think I started this two days ago, but I'm gonna cook this tomorrow and it's gonna be so yummy. Um, and if you're familiar with tocino, it's normally red, but that's because they add coloring. I didn't add any coloring, so it's just like its natural color, which is brown because it's brown sugar, soy sauce, 
some salt, garlic, and then I, I also add a little bit of rice vinegar. And it's so yummy. I can't wait to eat this. You guys remember our orchid plant? This side never grew out and I don't know why, but it's so sad. So it just has the flowers on this side. Will it focus? Will it focus? Maybe not, but yeah, it never grew flowers on this side. So yesterday I did two loads of laundry, but I did not fold any of the clothes that I washed. So right now I'm gonna fold the laundry and put everything away. And then I actually have one more load in the washing machine right now. About to leave, already packing Come with me, I'm not really asking We'll get away to a place where we don't know About to see the world in action What we can be, life with no distractions We'll get away this is what we waited for Take my hand, we'll make it somehow We can't miss out I'm done living life with the lights out Die with my own doubts Be free started fluffing the tree uh, but I mostly just did the top because you can see the bottom still needs to be done and then I also need to do the back but I was thinking what if I just don't do the back I mean who's gonna know right I mean you guys will know but like doesn't really matter right <laughs> I don't know we'll see so you guys we just had dinner and we had pork chops for dinner and it was so good I haven't had a pork chop in so long I don't know why I think I really think I forgot that pork chops existed so the pork chop was so good. I'm definitely going to add that into our rotation because it was so good. It's cheap and it's easy to make. Now I'm just having some, I guess dessert. I'm having some fruit. This is persimmon. Do you guys like persimmon? Let me know. Or if you're Filipino, persimmon. <laughs> so good. Now we are at Trader Joe's. We're gonna check out some holiday stuff, right? Yeah. Wow, this camera is good. Really? It's super focused on you. I'm filming on my phone, by the way. Okay, guys, come to Trader Joe's and get your chocolate advent calendars. They are only 99 cents and they have tons of different designs to choose from. So we're looking at the cheese um, because I want to make like just a small cheese board for Thanksgiving. I'm not going to do like a whole big charcuterie board like how I did last year just because it's only the four of us. So I was thinking of getting this, this cheese party tray. It comes with sliced Colby, uh, Swiss cheese, mild cheddar and pepper jack cheese and it's perfect. It's only $5.99. They do have, they, I was actually going to get this at Costco but it's pretty big and I think this is just the perfect amount for us. 
and they also have this too if you just want cheddar but i think i'm gonna get this oh and another thing actually that we came for are these olive olive wood cheese board and cutting boards look at these these are so nice you guys they're only 12.99 i love them we already have one in our basket you guys they have so many peppermint items everything peppermint you guys what is this is this just cookies oh like an assortment of things but look they have these peppermint pretzels but i think they're like those peppermint thins because it says pepper it says pretzel slims and i don't really like those thin pretzels but then they also have these they have trader joe's brand mochi wow i love mochi they have peppermint bark they also have peppermint creams soft creamy and minty bites they also have dark chocolate covered peppermint jojos so this is basically like a it's like an oreo but covered in chocolate right with peppermint and then they have candy cane jojos and they also have oh is that the same thing yeah. oh that's gluten free and they have mini peppermint meringue fat free fat free all right guys we're back home from trader joe's this is the board that i got it's so pretty i really love it it was 12.99 and i actually did film a trader joe's haul it's gonna go on my other channel if you guys want to see what i got i mean i didn't get like too many things but i still decided to film a haul all right everyone it is that time again you know what it is it's time to go to sleep thank you guys for watching and we'll see you guys tomorrow good night